Today, I'm going to be showing you guys the best tips and tricks to get better in Balloon CD Battles 2. We talk about things like how to farm, what strategies to use, and much, much more. So if you guys do enjoy today's video, let me know by dropping a like. And if you want to see more content like this, drop a like. And as well, make sure to subscribe if you want to be a pro Balloons player like me. And it looks like our opponent's going to be rocking with Agent Jericho as his hero, which is honestly one of the worst heroes in the game. We have my boy Quincy, who is definitely one of the best. And we got the map Sun Palace using the strategy of Dartling Farm Super Monkey. We're definitely going to want to start off this game with using a Dartling Gunner. And look, he's going to be starting off with a Dartling Gunner too. Okay, fair play. Well done. Yeah, I kind of like his spot, not going to lie. Maybe actually like more like over here. And if we like target it to like right here, this should be pretty good. We also do want to make sure that we go for a round one Quincy here, which I think honestly like he's better at cleaning up, right? So like probably like somewhere back here. More to the back of the map. Oh, we didn't get that XP. Because I, I forgot to set him down before the start of round two here, okay? Ooh, Sniper. Okay, fair play. Well done. Sniper is super, super good. Okay, so we finally have enough money to go for a banana farm. Definitely want to go for that before the start of the next round. So there we go with that. Ooh, are we about to leak? Nope. As they say... Oh, wait, no. One balloon. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. I can't move my Dartling Gunner. What? Okay, I think what I need to do is set target... Maybe it's like right here. Yeah, that should be pretty good. He went for another sniper. Yo, sniper is pretty cracked, bro. I probably should have went for that. Not gonna lie. Here, wait, wait. Let me set down my um, balloon bot as well. Just because it looks kind of cool. I don't actually want to use it because sending balloons typically isn't good. Especially when farming. Guys, we're making tons and tons of money right now from our farm game. I mean, look, we have $2,000 right now. So... We have a lot of freaking money coming in left and right. You know what? I think we should probably go for at this point, though. A super monkey. Now, where exactly do I want that? Super monkey. We'll be able to dark shift it, right? Maybe. Yo, let's put it right next to the Dartling Gunner because actually, if you put towers near each other, they actually defend a lot better. And no, I'm not lying. That's exactly why our opponent's doing that over there with his setup. Oh, he went for a farm, too. Oh, that's super smart. Okay, wait. I probably should go for another farm, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go for another farm right there. Beautiful. Oh, and there he goes with Agent Jericho. Again, Agent Jericho. That's a terrible spot, by the way. But Agent Jericho is one of the worst heroes in all of Battles 2. So, not sure, like, what he's thinking. Because, like, bro, nothing gets past Quincy's boat. Okay, one balloon did. That one pesky red balloon. But, you know, man, he can't do everything, right? He, he still did pretty freaking good. Let's go for another farm here. Can I set down a farm? Maybe... Just set it directly in the center of the map. Yeah. I probably won't even go for any towers anyway directly in the center of the map. So, it's absolutely fine. Oh, my God. Look at our money. Bro. And look at the amount of banana farms that we have. Holy. We have one more than him, bro. Holy crap. We are going hard in the freaking paint. Let's just continue on spamming the heck out of these. Why not? I mean, honestly, at this point, the more the merrier for sure. Ooh, wait. We can send purples. Yo, purples are so OP. Send those. Send those. He'll probably die, right? No, he's shredding. Oh my, yo, wait, what is shredding that for him? What in the world? I thought purples were supposed to always kill your opponents. Hey man, maybe they nerfed purples and I just did not realize, all right? But we're gonna go for yet again another farm. Dude, he's copying us. Player literally, like, he, he knows the strats, but we still, I think, have one more farm than him. So we're getting a lot more money, that's for sure. Okay, we gotta watch out here now because it's now round 10. We can send lead balloons. Now, should I send those? Yeah, let's send those. Oh, wait, there's camels over on my side? Wait, 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 Quincy level 3? Surely with that, we're fine, right? Yeah, 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 we are. Okay, beautiful. You know what? I think what we need to do is actually upgrade. Okay, I'm going to have to sell a few of my farms probably to defend against these camel balloons here. So let's sell, sell, sell. Ultra Vision. That's going to be our best bet here with popping these camel balloons down, okay? So happy that I got that. Um, ooh, wait, ceramic space ceramics are super, super good. Let's send those. Very, very OP rush here. Let's see if we can take down our opponent. And it's very good to eco with these as well. As you can see, five eco for each set that we send. And look at our opponent's side. Look at it. Is he dead? Oh, <gasps> he might have died. Did we, did we die? <gasps> we, we won. We won. He died first. Let's go. See, like I said. If you just follow everything that I did in that game, not to a T, but for the most part, you're going to get wins easily, just like we did right there. Let's play another one, though.
All right, don't sleep on this hero because Flossy the Snowman is honestly one of the better heroes in Battles 2. And it looks like our opponent's using Oban. Oban is terrible. And this time, we're going to be using the strategy of Dart, Farm, Ice. This is the meta right now, so we should easily win this game here. Okay, we're definitely going to want to start off with the Dart Monkey. The Dart Monkey is very, very good in a spot like this, too. It's going to be absolutely insane for us. Our opponent started off with Oban. Okay, again, Oban's not all that good, but... Where do we want Pat Fusty, or Fusty the Snowman, I'm sorry. I'm thinking directly in the center of the water because, yeah, fun fact, Fusty the Snowman can go in the water. That's how tall he is. And this spot's super, super OP. Like, watch us shred these red balloons right here. Okay, okay, okay. He, he wanted the Dart Monkey to pop the balloons there. Wait, why would you send space screens? We're absolutely fine there. Okay, I'm going to go for a farm. Like, what? <laughs> Literally, okay, and you stopped? We're actually so fine, right? Fusty? Fusty, yo! Fusty, okay, let's tower boost. Okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Hmm. We leak some lines for sure, but you know what? We got that increase of attack speed. So the Dart Monkey, it works like the Druid. For every light that you leak, you get a 1% increase of attack speed. So now our Dart Monkey is going to be firing super, super fast. And wait, he went for the Wizard? Oh, because Oban does buff uh, Wizard Monkeys only, okay? So definitely a smart play there. Okay, yeah, wait, let me let me get to spamming the uh, farms here. Oh my god, we could go for two? And look, we're absolutely shredding these balloons with just Fussy the Snowman and this Dart Monkey right here. Although, I think for round five Space Whites, we're going to have to go for an Ice Monkey. Now, the ice is very, very good at popping white balloons. So, I'll probably just have it right here directly at the start of where the balloon sends come from my opponent. And unfortunately, you can't go for all that many farms on this map. Oh, wait, you can go for four over here? Okay, so let's go for another one over there. Beautiful. Wall of Fire, by the way, not too good of an upgrade. It can't even pop Purple Balloons, so that's how you know it's super, super bad, man. But I'm going to go for probably another farm over here. So we already have five farms on round six. Oh, wait, Black Balloons? Okay. Um, hmm, Maybe we go for a Triple Shot here. Yeah, we're going to have to upgrade just a little bit here. Now, Triple Shot during the earlier game rounds, super, super solid. Let's actually go for the Racer Sharp Shots as well. Okay, wait, this is bad, guys. This is bad. Let's tower boost this. Tower boost, tower boost, tower boost. Okay, it looks like we need a little bit of help. A little bit of help here. I mean, surely we don't die here, right? I mean, I I'm just trying to get in my opponent's head, make them think that they have the advantage here, but that, that is simply not the case, okay? He did, or she did. Sorry, her name's Alyssa. Oh, I'm so sorry, Alyssa, but she, she did kind of slow down my farm game here, which kind of sucks. You know what, too? Uh, I kind of want to move Fussy the Snowman here. Yeah, so it's okay if you, like, want to sell your hero to replace it. I don't think it's that big of a deal. So, I think, like, up here, like, maybe, like, right here should be a lot better. Ooh, those purple balloons. Oh, yeah. Let's send the purples. Oh, he'll die to purples, bro. Purples are so OP. Ooh, a few zebras there. Okay, just, just go for another dart monkey. We're good. Look, he's dying to the purples. I repeat, he is dying. Spike Factory. No. No, Spike Factory is the best tower in the game, bro. Ninja 2? Oh, my God. Wait, how is he not dead? Oh, my God. Just at the last game, man. Literally, purple suck. They must have nerfed them or something. Like, he, he totally should be dead here, bro. Like, what even? Okay. What should we go for, though? Hmm. I think we should probably try to save up for a Super Monkey Fan Club. And now, the Super Monkey Fan Club affects up to 10 Dart Monkeys, so... We got five currently, six. Hmm, let's make sure that we have some, like, over here. Seven, eight, nine. Oh, wait, that's nine right there. Ten, ooh, camos. Um, I think, okay, we could just tank that. It's absolutely fine. Just one one camo green isn't going to kill us, you know? It, it's not that big of a deal. Uh, but now we'll have enough money, or hopefully soon, to go for the Super Monkey Fan Club. Because, again, very, very OP stuff there. He went for another Spike Factory, bro. No, I can't do anything to that. Like, I don't even want to try with the purples again. Oh, ceramics. Okay, let me let me upgrade a few of these dart monkeys first. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Tower boost that. Oh, no. Oh, no. I had, to, I had to move. I had to move him. I had to move him there. I don't know, man. Like, he wasn't doing that good at that spot. But he does get buffed when he is in the water, by the way. I forgot to tell y'all that. But them pesky, pesky leads, dude. Okay, so we're going to have to watch out for those for sure. What's going to be a good way then? You know what? Oh, I have the perfect idea. Let's go for like a juggernaut here. Beautiful. Now, we're going to go for this 
We're going to cr cross path it with a bottom path uh, because you get cam detection with it. We're going to set it to strong, by the way, and look at how OP this thing is. Now we should be absolutely fine, but like what gets through our opponent's defenses? Ooh, wait, the purples. Still giving them some struggles. Hmm. I think I want to send a rush here very, very soon. Oh, wait, no. It's about to be round 17. It is so good to eco with Moabs here. Okay, so we're going to get to that and increase your eco by an insane amount. But wait, is he going to be able to shred them? He definitely has got to watch out. Spike Factory, again, is pretty OP. But I'm just going to send three for now. Because I, I kind of want to put more money into my farm game. I mean, we're making tons and tons of money. Don't get me wrong from the farms. But I think he's fine there, honestly. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh. Oh, no. He almost died, bro. Wait. Does the last mob get him? <gasps> no. No, Spike Factory. No, we win. Let's go, dude. Eagle Wool Mobs. Again. It increases your equal by an insane amount. And two, somehow we got the win on Alyssa. Oh my goodness. GG's Alyssa. Oh no, now we got Purple Dolphin 23. And look at his badges. This guy is definitely pretty good. Okay, so we're going to want a little bit of a better hero. Maybe skip this map though. Let's see if we would get Oasis. Yo, okay. So I'm thinking, honestly, Cyber Quincy. Okay, now he might be... Oh, oh my God. It's his brother. Oh. Do I want some? Absolutely. I do want some Quincy. Okay. Cyber Quincy for this map specifically might be a little bit better. Now, I think we switch out the ice with the glue. And I think mm, maybe we should go with the Boomer instead. Yeah, Boomer Farm Glue. Now, this is like an up-and-coming strategy. It's currently still in the works. A lot of people, though, in the highest arena, Hall of Masters, use this strategy. And they get a lot, a lot of easy wins. And now, definitely starting off with the glue immediately right at the front of the map. Just to slow down the balloons, giving you more time to pop down everything, is going to be the play. He's going to be starting off with Quincy. Okay, fair play. Well done. But look at this. It slows down the balloons so much. It's so good, bro. Okay, so if we want to, like, absolutely slow them down even more, we're going to want to go for the middle path upgrades and then the bottom path upgrades. Now, these balloons are all going to have glue all over them man and it's just gonna be so freaking crazy i mean look at this hmm but now these rounds are getting a little bit harder so maybe before we actually go for a farm here we want to go for cyber quincy now cyber quincy hmm better clean up here as well so we're gonna want him probably like all the way in the back of the map because again he's a good cleanup hero okay but it's round three we also do want to make sure that we go for a farm can i go for a farm anywhere on this map hmm Oh, no. I can't go for a farm. Any Okay. It's going to have to be, like, right here, I guess. I know. It's not the best spot. Super Monkey! Oh, my God. Remember the first game? It, Super Monkey is definitely the best tower and is so good during the earlier game rounds. There's nothing that's going to be able to get past that, bro. How did I forget about that, man? Okay. I need to go for more farms, though, because if I want to go for better defenses, obviously, I need money. Maybe, too. Let's set down this uh, balloon bot now. I'm not sure what this exactly does. Um, okay. It's, look at the range on it. It freaking... Wait. What? I'm selling this. Wait, it's not... Look, 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 look. Whoa, watch, 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 watch. If I set it down, like, right here at the front of the map, it's not even... What? You have a pitchfork and you're not even popping the balloons? What? Dude, this thing's... No, I'm just selling that. I don't even care. I'm just... <gasps> bottom path upgrades. Wait. Wait, guys. I completely forgot. Okay. We need to go for the long life bananas. This upgrade, crazy, crazy OP. Let's also go for the easy collect and the banana salvage upgrade. I completely forgot to go for those, bro. No wonder why we have it. Like, we've been making tons and tons of money. Don't get me wrong, but we could make even more money here. You know what I'm saying? So, long life bananas, banana salvage right there. Beautiful. Ooh, we went for another farm? I don't know why. Okay, let me go for another farm as well. Where can I even go for another farm? Uh, oh, ooh, ooh, up here next to my balloon bot. Now, the balloon bot will actually buff this farm here. Fun fact. So that will be pretty cool. Zero, one, two, cross path. Oh, wait. Cyber Quincy, what the heck? Nothing is supposed to get past this man's bow. And like, here he is leaking. Hmm, maybe we should upgrade this glue then to the glue hose. He's gonna give us a thumbs up. Yo, our opponent's letting us know like, hey, you're absolutely doing the right thing here. I appreciate that. Thank you. Hmm, well, I think we should honestly go for another glue. And now... I'm going to put y'all on something that not too many people know about. We're going to be going for the Moab glue. And you might think to yourself, well, Bojack's only round not. But the thing is, we want to mainly get the Relentless glue upgrade, okay? So I think we should probably sell our farms 
so that we can go for that upgrade a little bit sooner. So, ooh, we actually, ooh, Cyber Quincy, like, see, you see how bad Cyber Quincy is? Oh my, okay, we have to sell our last farm. Relentless Glue, but we need a cross path with the top path. Now, this is going to be our main source of camo popping power. This thing absolutely shreds camo balloons here, okay? So, look at this. Look at how slow the balloons are. Okay, maybe I should move Cyber Quincy, by the way, to like more over here, by the way. Yeah, I think this is going to be a little bit better for us. Round 12. Oh, oh, read your rainbows. Read your rainbows. Balloon boost them as well, baby. I forgot to show you guys the region rainbows. Look how OP they are. Look how OP they are. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Yo, dude, region rainbows. Dude, for some reason, again, they nerfed purples. Like, I, I don't know what exactly they did, but purples suck nowadays. I think the region rainbows there on round 12 specifically are definitely a better rush. Yo, GG's overall, and I hope you guys learned a lot from this video. If you did, let me know by dropping a like on this video. And as well, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe. We're obviously the best player in Battles 2, and if you subscribe, you'll become as good as me. And if you haven't already, make sure to check out this video where this is the best Dart Monkey strategy in Balloon CD Battles 2. And one more thing, I know it's April 2nd, but April Fool's.